You know, Tom, all you need is death. And that's the title of the movie that I watched. <coughs> this is another one that I hadn't heard of at all. I hadn't seen anybody talking about it. And uh, why did I watch it on? Shutter, AMC, one of those fucking things. <coughs> this is an Irish movie, Tom. So they'd be talking like this. Well, not like that. They got a like a different weird accent. <clears throat> You know that one we watched last week that was in England? Was it last week? No, the week before. I thought that was Ireland throughout most of the movie. <clears throat> but it's not. This one, this one is Ireland. And there's this couple, you see. And they're going around and trying to find old songs, Tom. Old folk songs. Because there's some eccentrics. Are they fucking occultists or whatever? We don't know, but they find these songs and then they'll try to take them to like some rich dude to listen and like, ah, I don't know if you can verify this one, Lassie. So let me know when you find something with some verification or something. You know, this is a variation of this and that. And so, God damn it, they're just trying to make a buck here and there, you know, and, and they play in a band too, you know, so they know a little bit about music. <clears throat> they go to this... uh I guess this class, this it's older lady, you know, things, uh, or she, that's all she talks about is these old mythic and folk songs. And, you know, the one that they found, they tell her about it. And she goes, well, where'd you find this? Well, I don't know. But this other guy told us about this old lady. Have you ever heard of her? She goes, well, yeah, that lady's dead, you know, so you probably won't be finding anything from her. Well, so, well maybe they're talking about her daughter. Maybe, maybe. So they track down that town, you know, and they get somebody to take her, take, you know, the local that knows her and say, oh, yeah, she's a fucking old drunk. And she is. And they get there and that teacher lady's already there, Tom. She's already there. She fucking bamboozled them trying to get the slip, you know. <clears throat> this lady, you know, in between taking a slug of, you know, her rot gut whiskey that she's drinking. She tells me, yeah, well, here's one you've never heard. It was passed down from me, ma'am. And she was passed down from her, ma'am. You know, and this is you, lad. You got to leave the room. This is not a song for men. And he's got to leave. She's like, can't write this one. Can't write, record it. You can't do anything. The girl promises, okay, I won't. She starts singing this song, and while she's singing, it's flashing back to the ancient times, you know, when these white people would paint their faces blue and, you know, wear horns and stuff. You know, we just see glimpses of that. And they're taking off, and yeah, didn't record it, but that other teacher lady did, Tom. She recorded that shit. And they're like, hey, <coughs> we want some of that money, too. We were there. And uh, then some fucking weird ghosts come and kill the old lady. And uh, they're shitty looking ghosts. It's just like black splotches, you know, just like, I don't know. It's, it just looks real bad, like real, real bad. But that's okay because they never explain them anyway. You know, it's like, it's a throwaway shit. But anyway, this song, it, it, what it does, it, it like uh, puts men under a thrall. You know, and the old lady uses it to steal the, the, the boyfriend, you know. and But, like, now all he wants to do is fuck. Like, he can't live for anything else. Just like, hey, that's all he wants to do is fuck. And, yep. But the, the old lady's son, he's coming. He wants revenge, you know. But uh, he's trying to figure out the song, too. And he's getting fucked over by it. And then the old gods are coming back because of this song and shit and uh everybody's fucked over by the end and i fucking liked it uh yeah this is the cool kind of folk horror as they call it now that uh yeah it'll be in volume nine probably of the all the haunts vr's box set and it deserves a place there you know i really like it if you're into these kind of movies this is a fucking good one uh 
Yeah, I put it on a list. And uh, it's not for you, Tom. It is definitely not uh, not something you would enjoy. But anybody else out there, you see, you're into this kind of shit. This one's fucking top of the line. At least I think so. Thanks for checking out the show. We hope you dug it, baby. And if so, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe and let us know down below. Support Tom and Joe. By heading over to dwnproductions.net and fastcustomshirts.com. Until next time, Lord God.